this is Sahi from Techitwix. Welcome to our channel. And in this video, we we'll look at Hydrogen OS for this OnePlus 3. Right now, we are running this what you say reception remix ROM for OnePlus 3. And I have to say, this ROM is a very good ROM. The performance I am getting with this ROM is really good. Also, the battery life is good too. Let me hold the adjust the camera a bit. Sorry for that. So, guys, uh, for that you need to download these two files hydrogen os d bloater and one plus three hydrogen os so after downloading th uh, these two files also you have to download uh, open g apps for your one plus three as you can see here are the open g apps pico and uh, the, all the links will be in given in description box down below so let me show you the settings now so as to confirm So if you don't know about routing guys you can ask me in comment section down below or I will make a dedicated video for that. As you can see we are on Restriction Remix ROM what you have to do is now just reboot to your recovery. Wait for a while when it will reboot to recovery the procedure will start then. Also guys do note that if you don't know anything about this procedure please ask me please don't spoil your parents money. Please ask me once or your own earned money. So as you can see now it has been booted to the recovery. What was our password? Our password was 1, 2, 3, 4. Okay. As you saw we have given the password and this is the things, thing which I don't see often. It is little bit too bright so let me adjust the focusing exposure. So now what you have to do is first go to wipe and uh, swipe to factory reset it will take a second and after that you have to go to install and f first you have to install the oneplus 3 hydrogen rom it will take some time to install so so guys as you can see it has been complete and in my case it has took me around four five minutes please be patient in that time now you have to go back and uh, also flash this uh, hydrogen os d bloater and it has super su built in so as you guys can see it has completed the flashing process now you have to install the g apps file as you can see it is open g apps so it will also take some time so let me fast forward now so guys this also has been completed so after flashing three files first was hydrogen OS, second was d bloater and g apps you have to wipe your cache and then reboot your system and for the first boot it may take some time like 10 minutes or so so you have to be really patient in that time so as you can see it gave me haptic feedback and let's adjust the exposure now it is much better i know guys and you will actually see a new boot animation now as you can see it is hydrogen os and now i will uh, come when this device will actually set up and before going uh, this may take around uh, some 10 minutes so please be patient so i'll be back okay, guys we are, uh, are now boot up into this hydrogen os and as soon as i got into this hydrogen os i was actually amazed this is a different ui looking i will not say it is looking similar to the ios but it is looking something like a me ui as you can see that everything is changed and it looks good to be really true it looks good so let's go to about phone and uh, these are the specifications of this device as you can see this is hydrogen os version 1.4.0 and uh, let's see the fingerprint speed then the fingerprint is really fast and one annoying thing is that uh, there are no actually quick settings in this update as you can see i am swiping and when you will press here this will open the apps notification ma management so this is the oneplus uh, 3's hydrogen os and also the camera ui is a bit similar to what we get in oxygen os but uh, with the little bit of tweaks as you can see everything is similar to what we get in oxygen os every camera mode is also similar as you can already see so this is the hydrogen os for oneplus 3 guys and i have taught how to install it and let's see the gallery as well as you can see the gallery is also changed up a bit 
the color schemes are actually changed and this was the pic i took with this uh, hydrogen os right now and the camera quality quality is also good and uh, let's me show you the settings in depth the amount of customization that this one has is okay not too much as you can see three key and zen mode uh, actually three key is uh, this alert slider and in display you don't have oh sorry in sound you don't have enough options and in display there are something like dark mode and uh, buttons backlit etc but actually uh, the amount of customization we are getting in hydrogen os is not that great as compared to oxygen os but actually it feels good it feels something new and uh, the little bit of customization is here in iq settings as you can see press power button twice for camera double tap to wake and main main settings are here only as you can see these are some gestures actually nothing new and it also has that pocket mode that whenever this device will be in pocket it will not wake up the screen and somebody from uh, uh, somebody was asking me in, in comment section so this is the answer to that, that question and let's see the batting, battery nothing here we, you can get this as you can see it is looking like me UI looking clean neat and guys in case you wanna follow me on facebook twitter the all links will be given in description box down below and if you want to support tech Quix, please use the affiliate links which are given in description box again this was pretty much it from the video guys if you have liked the video please hit that like button and for more such videos like this you can always comment in comment section down below and uh, if you want some uh, dedicated video for any us you can always comment in comment section down below so this is sai from tech Quix signing off